Well, I got down to this gardenia bush and it's pretty well had it. The trunk wood looks kind of green down at the base. I'm sure hoping it'll come back. We'll give it a while to see. Maybe I shouldn't be too quick to prune it. That one's definitely dead. I don't know about this one over here, but see, that's gardenia leaves right there. Sure got my hopes up for that one. Get off of me, bug. I don't even want to know what kind of bug is crawling on me. The question is, can that gardenia bush be saved? I did some radical pruning, and I'm half tempted just to whack it down. But I think it deserves a chance to live. I'm going to leave it sit up here for six months or a year and see if it'll come back. Those are gardenia leaves right there. So our green leaves indicates to me some of that plant's still alive. These old vines were eating it up. Uh, it used to make some beautiful gardenias. I run my mower around here. Now that one over there, I got more green leaves on it, but I haven't pulled the vines off yet. So this is going to be a radical experiment. Can the gardenia bushes be saved? If so, what do I need to do to mulch them? I'm sure with this summer heat. Turn vine, let go of me.
That has got to be the world's ugliest gardenia bush. Poor little gardenia bush has seen better days. I still haven't got all the vines pulled out of it and found a bunch of poison oak in there. Can't trim too much right now. I'll clean up the vines that I have pulled out work on it some more tomorrow. I got green leaves on that gardenia bush. Quite a few of them. We can prune out the dead limbs when we see what part of it's alive. We're making an attempt to save this gardenia bush.